Welcome to this video guys. In this video, I will show you how you can create your first Python project in Visual Studio Code and what are the necessary extensions to help you with debugging and running Python code. First, open your Visual Studio Code and first of all, before installing anything, what you can do is you can just click on this open folder by clicking this button here or go to file and click on open folder here. And then wherever you want, go to that directory and create a new uh, project folder for your Python project. So I'll just click on this new folder and call it my first Py project. Click enter and click on select folder and this folder will now open in your Visual Studio code. So what we will do is, okay, so if you see this, you can just click on I trust the authors. So now we have our project here, which is empty. We don't have any files here. You can just create new files if you want here. So I'll just call it, let's say readme.md or whatever. So this is how you can create a new file. Now, coming back to creating Python projects. So we have our project ready. We just need to fill this with Python files. Now, one thing is you will need to install Python first so that you can run it in Visual Studio Code. So uh, it doesn't matter if it's Python, PHP or anything, whatever language you want to code for, you will have to first have that language installed and then only you can run it using Visual Studio Code. So first, what you can do is you can go to python.org and download and install Python by just clicking this and then installing it. If you are not sure how you can install this, check the link in the description. It will show you how you can exactly install the specific Python version required for you. And once you have your Python version installed, let's create a file called main.py. You can call it anything you want. Now, Python files have the extension py, so we'll just call this main.py. And here, let's write our first Python code. So yeah, we'll just print hello world. And this circular icon here shows that this file is not yet saved. So you can press Ctrl and S to save it. And once this is saved, you should be able to run it. But first, we need to install two extensions. Now, you'll see this pop up here that says install the recommended Python extension. You can close this and click on this icon here that says extensions. And the shortcut to open this is Ctrl, Shift, and X. Or you can just click on this. And now search for Python. And you will see these extensions on top that is officially from Microsoft itself. So just click on this and click on install. Once this is installed, you can go back to your main.py file. And now you can run this by going to terminal and clicking new terminal. And then typing Python and then main.py. Now this is a bit of long process. So I'll show you how you can do this or run this just by click of a button. So basically, this is how you can run your Python files also. If there is another file, let's call it new uh, main 2py And again, let's print hello world from two. And now you can also run this by doing the same thing by clicking on this terminal, opening terminal and typing Python and then the file name. So wherever you are, so if you want to run main, you can just do python main.py. And if you want to run main2.py, you just type python main2.py. Okay. So now this is quite a long process. So what you can do is you can just click on this here. Now to run this, you will have to have this extension that I just installed Python. So if you don't have this extension installed, you will not see this. Once this is installed, you can just click on this play button or run button and it will run the chosen file. If I go back to this and click on this, this file will be run. So this is how you can set up extensions and create your first Python project in Visual Studio Code. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.